Future Inventions That Will Change the World Hey everyone, you know no one can know for sure what the future is going to hold, but some current inventions can give us at least a glimpse into what the future might look like. Inventions have always had the power to change the future, and some inventions have had such a prolific impact on the world that it's impossible to imagine the world without them. Join us for today's video. We're going to explore the top 15 most amazing inventions that will change the future. 1. Invisibility Cloaks Stepping into the realm of sci-fi and fantasy, this next amazing invention has ignited imaginations for centuries. What if we could become invisible? Well, invisibility cloaks have always been the stuff of fiction, but it turns out we're a little closer than you might think to having the ability to turn ourselves invisible. No, we haven't figured out how to use magic. These cloaks utilize science. These invisibility cloaks would center around something called metamaterials, which are metal dielectric. Composites engineered on a nanoscale basically the composite structure acts as an array of artificial atoms enabling electromagnetic radiation to pass freely around an object the material guides light around something creating an illusion that the object isn't really there scientists from Duke University created an invisibility cloak using metamaterials in 2006. It didn't completely make an object invisible too the human eye but it was a giant leap forward in this technology years later a team from hyper stealth biotechnology corporation in canada developed something they called quantum stealth it's a patented prototype material that's being developed for military use the material could be used to hide things like jets and tanks and combat as well as military personnel videos and pictures of quantum stealth technology are pretty unbelievable and speak to the future of invisibility cloaking two flying jets Something straight out of a scene from the Jetsons, it might not be long before we're flying around in cars. Two personal flying vehicles have already been invented. SkyDrive, for example, is an emission-free, ultra-quiet, compact personal vehicle that looks so futuristic it looks like it belongs on another planet. It's still in the prototype stages, though, but the idea is that this little vehicle can transport you or goods more quickly and efficiently than road mount vehicles it can fly autonomously or with a pilot and has a maximum speed of about 100 kilometers per hour and a flying altitude of about 500 meters and along with simple personal pleasure this flying vehicle has some other significant applications it could for example be used in emergency situations instead of being at the mercy of roads or traffic flying vehicles could quickly transport paramedics and patients without any hold UPS. It could also travel easily to places that cars can't, which could be especially useful for rescue missions. So how close are we to driving in the skies? Well, SkyDrive showcased their prototype at the CES 2022, and the prototype was called Stu-3, and they intend to use that model as an air taxi. They also intend to have the next iteration, the SD-05, ready for the 2025 World Expo. So please fasten your seatbelts and ensure that your tables are in their upright positions, because we might be skybound sooner than you think. 3. Floating Farms Continue to grow the invention of floating farms offers a way for people to get fresh produce and other products without taking up valuable space within the cities. The first floating farm is located in Rotterdam and it's a fresh floating dairy farm. There are 40 cows that live on the farm and the milk and other dairy products is processed right on site. The farm was created by Peter and Minka van Winga Garden and the idea is to use residual products from cities like food waste and cut grass from parks. It will also cut down food transportation because the floating farms are close to the cities unlike rural farms which are often pretty far both will in turn cut down on the carbon footprint of food production and transportation now these floating farms will also utilize solar energy via solar panels as well as rain water these farms could be built on any type of water including nearby lakes and oceans and furthermore they can include not just dairy farms but most types of agriculture and their close proximity to the cities they feed could reduce the cost to consumers so perhaps it would allow people to eat fresher and healthier foods floating farms they're an amazing invention that speaks to the future of sustainable agriculture and they really have the potential to change the face of farming plus they look really cool too four 3d printed food is an invention that's already changing the world and we're still exploring the realms of what we can do with this amazing technology but when it comes to significant applications for 3d printing printed food is an amazing invention that has the potential to change the world as we know it in fact it already is changing the world as 3d printed food is popping up in restaurants currently we're pretty limited in what foods we can print paste like inputs such as 
Moses chocolate ganache purees mashes doughs and soft cheeses the process is the same as with anything 3D printed the soft material is fed into a syringe like container and then the mixture is extruded from a nozzle that moves around and traces a shape to form 2D layers one at a time 3D printed food is really only used in gourmet restaurants right now as a cool novelty menu item but this type of 3D printing is still in its infancy the benefits are plentiful it allows for normally unappetizing Foods tube look aesthetic and therefore more appealing nutrient and vitamin rich foods like insect puree could be presented in a beautiful way so instead of eating insects still in insect form or even worse insect mush they could be printed into an intricate and lovely little insect candy and 3D printing food allows for a level of precision that the human hand simply can't make so you can print up some pretty complex and wild food this way and of course it is far less labor intensive than actually preparing the food it's hard just to say how much of an impact 3D food printing will have but it's safe to say that it will have some sort of impact even if it's just making healthy but gross looking foods more appetizing. 5. Self-driving cars. Of us that spend hours of our precious time and daily commutes we know all too well that the struggle is real inching along bumper to bumper literally just wasting time stuck behind the wheel. What if we could better use that time you've likely heard of self-driving cars by now Tesla's already developed a complex autopilot mode but the reality is self-driving cars are still very much in development stages the concept is that passengers will be able to enjoy a commute or car ride because they'll be free to read binge and Netflix series or even sleep if you're a commuter what could you do at the time in your car if you didn't have to drive there are also some other benefits to self-driving cars such as a reduction in accidents due to human error self-driving cars come with a whole slew of questions though most of them safety related which is why they are still a work in progress but once all the kinks are worked out and self-driving cars become the norm while needless to say that this amazing event will impact our daily lives that we can even fully comprehend yet. 6. Banana Vaccines The theory behind banana vaccines is pretty simple. They're bananas that have been genetically engineered to carry vaccines all right. So why do they have the potential to change the future well? Because they could be an extremely inexpensive way to provide life-saving vaccines to children in third world countries biotechnologists at the Boyce. Thompson Institute for Plant Research has found a way to genetically engineer a banana to produce the antigen found in the outer coat of the hepatitis B virus. Now traditional doses of vaccines can cost between 100 to 200 bucks a dose, but banana vaccines can be made for as little as a few cents per dose. Furthermore, bananas aren't typically already grown in the countries that would need them the most so growing them wouldn't be a problem so just how influential could banana vaccines be well just 10 hectares of banana vaccines would be enough to vaccinate all the children in mexico under five that's mind-boggling and of course the bananas could be genetically engineered to have different vaccines but it doesn't just stop there the vaccines could be served as a puree and since it would be eaten it eliminates any risk of medical mistakes like vaccine injuries basically the vaccines wouldn't need to be administered by licensed professionals because there's no needles involved so they're not only a game changer in third world countries they can also be used for children all over the world since i'm pretty sure a child would choose a spoonful of banana puree over a needle any day i know i would what do you think of this cool tech and do you know any other life-changing inventions share them in the comments down below also check out our other cool stuff showing up on the screen right now and i'll see you in the next video take care everybody